So are we tatting today guys? Uh, yes we are tatting today and if you don't know what tatting is, tatting basically means dancing with your arms, yes. It involves your elbows, your wrists, your fingers, yeah, your whole arm. And the rule about tatting is very simple. Just one rule, you, you just have to maintain the 90 degrees with your arms. For example, this is 90 degrees. Whew. This is 90 degrees. 90 degrees 90 degrees 90 degrees and for beginners maybe it may be difficult to achieve the 90 degree rule because you find that your arm you find that this is your maximum range now there's a way i had i had somewhere that you can achieve this by putting your hands on the wall like this as a routine to do it maybe uh, twice every day for 10 minutes and with time your arms become more flexible yeah so i don't want to talk too much let's start today's lesson so by the end of this lesson you should be able to do this so the first step your right hand up your left hand up then put them together that's the first step so this is one so let's do it together five six seven eight one the second step our right hand will go this way from the wrist here it's only this part that is moving yes yes your left hand remains unchanged so five six seven eight huh and we do the same to the left hand so huh so the first step is that one, the second step, right hand, the second step, left hand. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three. Okay, the fourth step, we're going to slide our right arm upwards. Your left hand remains unchanged. So we just slide the right hand here on the palm. So we go that way. From here we go that way. So let's start from top. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And the fifth one, uh, our right hand again. Remember our left hand is still unchanged. So the, we are going to close in here. Only this part is moving this part only this part is moving and always remember to maintain the 90 degrees so we go that way that way so from top five six seven eight we go one two three four and five again five six seven eight one two three four and five now the sixth step we are going to slide our our right hand again remember the left hand remains unchanged, unchanged so we slide the right arm that way again so it's five and six five six seven eight five and six again five six seven eight five and six yeah so yeah, so let's start from top five, six, seven, eight. We go one, two, three, four, five, and six. Remember, your fingers should touch your elbows. So you just flatten your arms that way. Again, five, six, seven, eight. Huh. So let's start from top five, six, seven, eight. You go one. We go one and two and three and four and five and six then you flatten your arms that's seven and when you flatten your arms make sure your wrists here your wrists are together here yes so the eighth step we're going to take our right elbow downwards but the wrist remains our pivot so this way 
from this to this this to this this is the pivot doesn't move so five five six seven eight let's start from top five six seven eight we go one two three four five six seven and eight again five six seven eight we go one two three four five six seven eight now two more steps to go the ninth step we're going to push our right elbow using our left fingers that way that way your right your right arm remains unchanged it just moves slightly towards towards the right so it goes one so let's start again from top we go one two three four five six seven eight nine this is our tenth step ha huh. again ha huh. we're going to turn the wrist of your left arm that way and it goes along with the elbow of the right arm so we go ta again five six seven eight one so let's start again from top five six seven eight we go one and two and three and four and five and six seven eight nine ten the next step we're going to turn our right wrist that way just make it upright so one one and your left arm remains unchanged so it's one and then drop it slowly and we finish that way let's go from top five six seven eight we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven then twelve let's try to go a little bit faster so five six seven eight we go one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen good five six seven eight one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen So that was it guys that was the first starting lesson i have given to you and let's call it lesson one yes lesson one we shall have another starting lesson next week so stay tuned